Hello boys and girls, good afternoon. Welcome to Shen Plays. About ready to get started with another session of Europa Universalis 3, Divine Wind, Death and Taxes. We're now up to 7.3. There was another update released today. And I just finished one job, took a shower, and uh, got some underwear on and some socks and some hobo gloves. So now it's time to play some EU3. And then I can't play too long because i got to go to my other job, but we'll play for a little bit. So we left off after finishing a war against Yuan. And let's see, we've only progressed a, a couple years into the game. Uh, not much going on in Europe. Poland and Hungary have their vassals. Serbia's, Serbia annexed Bosnia. That happens frequently. Nothing else. Tyrone got Canucked. Eh, Nothing else major going on. Alright, so let's hop back in the game. Now this is going to be... Oops, did I click on someone? I think I clicked on some other faction. Nope, we're still Shia. Alright. Uh, so this is going to be a period of nothing, because we have to wait for our infamy to go down before we go to war again. So in the meantime, we could... Uh, in the meantime, we could start looking at some advisors we could get. I don't need this guy anymore. He's kind of costing us a few dollars that I don't want to spend. So, uh, go away. Get someone else, maybe? Interest, colonial range. No, no, no. We might as well get one of these guys for stability, but... Eh, why not? Alright, so we have a stability dude instead. That's nice. Let's focus on stability. We already are. It'll be up in next month. Good. Alright, let's unpause. Yeah, we have to wait for Infamy to go down. Trade dispute against Ming. Why are they embargoing us? Embargoing Shia and Yuan. I don't know why you're embargoing us. Anyway, Tianwan and Fong are still at war with Yuan. Fong and Tianwan. Yeah, separate wars. Hmm. Allied with Joseon, you're allied. But Joseon just lost a war. I'm not concerned about them. Let's see if we can't get some alliances over here. No, you're embargoing us. No. 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 We already have alliances here. No, no one really wants to ally with us, probably because we have a lot of infamy right now. Alright, that's fine. We'll just unpause and let it go. So we have a lot of magistrates. I know there's something we could do when we have magistrates. Hmm. Formalize weights and measures. We need government tech of 16, so that's not going to happen. Da, 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 da. Imperial examination. Ah, a level 4 statesman. That's what we need. And this will give us more magistrates every year, and it will give us centralization. So that's what we need. So we need a statesman of level 4. Well, I don't think there's any on the market. And I doubt we can create one with only 14 cultural traditions. So uh, what we can do is uh, build up our cultural tradition with some paintings. And there we go. And we still can't get one. We have to wait for uh, a while, I guess. Let's see. We can't change our government type at all. Okay. What we can do is start thinking about what we want to take for our first national idea at uh, Government Tech 6. But that's going to be a while, man. We don't get any government text. It says until 22 years from now. God damn. Hey, a general. Nice. He actually is really good. Look at that. Just out of nowhere, we got a fantastic general. 442. Beautiful. It's not like we have much army tradition, so that was really lucky. And we have to wait until we can build an embassy if we actually want our infamy to go down at a decent rate. We could spend cultural tradition to get... Uh, oh, we don't have enough prestige. Really? Mm. 
9.66. October for another stability boost. Man, they have a lot of fucking shit going on here. I wonder how much land Tianwan and Fong are going to take from them, because it could be a considerable portion of Yuan. Because the AI is not hindered by our... The AI is not hindered by our uh, very hard difficulty. So their infamy limit is going to be 16.2 instead of 6.2. Actually, if they have a better leader, then their infamy limit could be very high. So let's say uh, infamy limit right there. There, look at that. Infamy limit of 21. Oh my goodness, they could take so much land. Wow. <laughs> wow, really? Sukotai? Your leader is... Wow. Oh my goodness. Crazy names. Right down here. That's not that bad. That's not that bad. That's not that bad. Lana, not that bad. Khmer, not that bad. Ayadhaya, not that bad. But Sukotai, holy shit. Goddamn. Yeah, these motherfuckers have high infamy limits, and we do not. Alright, Song just had a province defect to it. Very cool. That'd be nice if we could get some of those as well. I'm not sure what will have happen at some point. But we wind up killing some of the rebels down here, so... Whatever. Who's this? Someone wants a marriage. Sure. Our prestige is actually going down from 9.66 to 9.47. That's not good. Yeah, it goes down by 0 0.05 every month. Well... Well, poop. Hey, we're not embargoed anymore. Good. Want an alliance? No. Let's give you some military access. Give you some access. Give you some access. Just make sure people don't want to invade us. And giving military access is a good way to prevent them from invading. It's no guarantee, but it's a pretty good way. So Song could wind up with a lot of territory up here if uh, these rebels are successful. Uh, Tianwan got out of the war. They didn't even take any land. Tianwan, you guys are weak. It's not how you do it, bro. What kind of rebels are these anyway? These are Chihan patriots from which dynasty is that? It's not that one. Yeah, it's Song. These guys are Song. So Song could wind up with a lot of territory here. And our prestige is still going down. Well, we could try to get one of these derp derps for prestige. Maybe there's one we could actually just buy? No. Alright, we'll get one for prestige. Level 3. Not bad. So he's going to improve our prestige a little bit. But I think it's still going to decay. It's just going to decay more slowly. Yeah. We'll see. 9.36. Check next month. No, it went up. Okay, so we're going to get some prestige now. Good. Then we can go back to doing paintings again. And that'll allow us to eventually get a fucking statesman. Taoist heretics. What are the religions around here anyway? We are... We are some type of Buddhism. Therav Theravadan Buddhism. And these provinces we took over are, Tao are Shenism. How fitting. Shen plays is taking over Shenism territories. Interesting. You are Cantonese patriots. Ah, these guys are our group. These guys are Shia patriots. So if they're successful, then Shia will get this province. Very cool. I'll take it. It's just grain, but I'll take it. No complaints here. Ooh, there's iron up there. What about culture? Yeah, it's not only showing the different culture. Cantonese, 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 Chihan. 
Damn it, that one's Chihan. Yep, Song's getting more provinces defecting to it. You guys want an alliance yet? No? How about you guys? No? I mean, I don't mind. I just, it would be nice. But no, apparently not. Does Yuan have any alliances yet? Hopefully not. Allied to Joseon. Oh, yeah, it's Joseon. Who cares about Joseon? We're landlocked. They're not. I don't think they're really a problem. Where is Nanjing? Nanjing. Ah, Ming. So that's why Ming are going to be rich, because they have all that Chinaware. What does Ming have? Yeah. Chinaware, 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 cotton, cloth, and grain, and fish. Ming has some good provinces. So does Song. Song has iron, cloth, cloth, cloth. Not Ming. What's up, then, Ning? You got a problem? Don't worry. We'll fix your problem. Hey, hey. Our patriots are going to take over some more provinces. Good. Give me both of those, please. And get me Duyun as well. Get me all these provinces. Thank you. Hey, these guys are my patriots too. Cool. But yeah, we're going to have to spend quite a bit of time waiting for Infamy to go down. Oh, these fuckers. They took over my stupid shit that the... Rebels got for me. Oh, that's right. I'm not funding my army right now. It's probably bad. Let's uh, fund the army just temporarily, you know, for the sake of winning this battle. There we go. And they're running to Heichi. Good, so are we. And they got there first. Damn it. That's okay. We killed them all. Alright, we can unfund the troops again. Save some dollars. Yeah, Song's getting some provinces. Damn. Alright, we're back up to 10 prestige. So that means we can uh, commission another painting. So what happens here? We lose one prestige every time we get a painting. Okay. But we need cultural tradition if we want to get a level 4 statesman. I mean, it's not like we have to. It's not like we have to do that thing over here, uh, Imperial Examination. Imperial Examination was an examination system, blah, blah, blah. Select the best administrative officials. I mean, I like it. You, you get centralization for free. You get more magistrates till the end of the game. So there's no reason not to do it. What did that say? Yuan declared war? No, peace with Dazu. White peace. All right. Ah, because there's a new king on the throne of Yuan. Well, not king, emperor. Yeah, I can't pronounce that. Not even going to try. <laughs> but you're still at war with Fong. It's going to be a while, huh? Our truce runs until 1364. All right. Can I get out of this war, please? No. Whatever. Revolt risk. Not that bad. So we are, we are Shenism, but these provinces are not Shen. These provinces, oops, I hit the mic. These provinces are Buddhist. Interesting. I hadn't even noticed that. But yeah, we are the wrong religion for our provinces. Oh well, the ones we're taking over now are Shen, so that's fine. Slightly efficient administration. Unsatisfactory administration. You guys want white peace? Come on, tell me it's white peace. I'll accept. Just get out of the damn war with the Timurids. I don't need that. Um, okay. Shia will pay 
Ninety dollars? I don't think so. How about you guys go to hell? Stupid motherfuckers. She will pay ninety dollars. Comet sighted. Fuck you. Uh, what the fuck was I doing? I forget what I was doing. But yeah, a statesman gives us government tech, which doesn't really do much good because these are going to take forever no matter what we do. Because our, our training rate is ridiculous. It says 100% efficiency, but that's not true because we have these modifiers over here, which reduce our efficiency quite a bit. We well, could try diplomacy again, but they already have three allies. So they probably say no. Oh, very unlikely. No, we'll try someone else. Very unlikely. Tianwan, Xi'an, and Dazo. Yo, you're allied with Xi'an, all right. Ming declared war on Yuan. Yeah, I figured that would happen. So who's gonna join? Joseon dishonored their alliance with Yuan. Nice. And we still have a truce for two years. Yep. Our stability has increased. Secret so affected to Jin. Jin completed save the Chihan people. Yuan got peace with Fong. Yuan will see Zhangzhou, Zhao King, Jinghai, blah, blah, blah. So these five provinces, essentially. For some reason, they wanted that strip of land. Whatever. I guess they figure that's going to block us off from taking these provinces over here. They might be right. I don't know. So Ming did not call their allies into the war with Yuan. Interesting. There we go. Chinese unification is Fong. <laughs> Allied with Dai Viet. How many units do you have yet? 11. It's more than me. Dahan and Dazo. Alright. Whatevs. Ming's already taking shit. Damn. They are not wasting time. How many units do they have? Uh, where's Yuan? Oh, there's Ming. Ming has 28,000. Holy shit. Yuan, 24,000. Yeah, so Ming is powerful as fuck. And we have missionaries. We should definitely start missionizing. Don't waste our money. Oh, we completed accumulate money. Give me another mission. Military leader died. Damn. Subjugation against Xi'an. Vassalize Xi'an. What will that give us? Lose to infamy. Ooh, that is tempting. I mean, they're our ally, though. We could always do it peacefully, I guess. Uh, yeah, let's uh, proclaim guarantee. And we'll see if... Uh, they will even come close to considering vassalization. I doubt it, but it's worth asking, I guess. I mean, we're more than twice as big as they are, but still. Impossible. Eh, oh well. <laughs> I guess if we take over some more shit, they may eventually agree to it. But hey, that's kind of cool. If we succeed, we lose to infamy. What do you want? No, I'm not going to give you money. You guys go to hell. Oh, yeah. Use our missionary on our capital. Good luck, sir. That's a little Buddhist dude. Well, I guess he's Shenist, not Buddhist. And all of you fuckers watching this on my channel, you guys are all Shenist as well. Shenism. Tolerance of heretics, plus 2. Stability cost, plus 15. Missionary chance, plus 3. Okay, those are kind of shitty bonuses, but whatever. Tolerance of heretics, missionary chance. It's the same fucking shit. 
whatever. How come you guys have more units than we do? The fuck's our limit? Eleven. All right, we'll build one more. What do we have? Eight and two. We'll do one more soldier. Yep, Ming is gonna win that war easily. Too bad our infamy limit is so low. 6.2. I mean, when the when the truce expires, we will only have enough room to get three provinces. I mean, that's just sad. It's like having handcuffs on, you know? You can't do anything. She will pay six bucks. Nope. I'm waiting for white peace. Nope. Oh, it's my rebels again. Good. Go rebels. Hey. Hey, are you at war? Yeah, you guys did something. What happened? Oh, you joined Ming's war. You're not going to get anything out of that. Hey, you're going to kill my rebels. Don't kill my rebels. You bastards, they're going to kill my rebels. Those are my rebels. Bastards. There you go, white piece. All right, we're almost there. What are we waiting for? October of next year. Okay. We'll get there. Very unlikely. Let's try song. Oh, auto save lag. No. Very unlikely. It's because you guys all have three alliances already. Ming, Fong, and Song. Dai Viet, Da Han, and Da Zhou. Josie, and Lan Zong, and Fong. Ming and Xia, you only have two. I already got my alliance with you. I need someone else. Whatever. Maybe you fools? No, you hate me. Whoa. Different religious group and our infamy. Wow. So having infamy at what was it at five? Having infamy at five is enough to get people to hate me. That's sad. Man, song is just getting tons of shit. Oh, Jin got that one. It's a little odd for Jin to get that. Whatever. Whatever. Hey, got new rebels. Go rebels, go. And we have a buttload of spies, so we could send rebels wherever we want. We should probably get one of those douchebags to reduce infamy. Yeah. Let's spend a little bit on paintings. And see if we can get a decent infamy reduction guy. Level 2. Well, it's better than nothing. Alright, so he's going to reduce infamy by 0.1 every month. Or, is that every month or every year? Well, eh, whatever. Probably every year. But it's better than we had before. Yeah, yearly infamy change. Oh, well. Scandal at the court. Lose prestige and stability. We'll lose the money instead. Alright, we're almost there. Oh, they re 
rejected our alliance. God damn it, fucking nationalist bastards. The fuck is wrong with you? Josie on. You know you want to. Alright, well we can start the war now, but first I want to see if we can get this alliance. Nope. Still no. Alright. Well, we're just going to start the war. Uh, Chinese Unification. Tibet will protect them. I doubt it. Tibet better join on my side. No, Tibet joined on Yuan's side. You gotta be kidding me. Fuck you, Tibet. Worst ally ever. Joseon, if you're gonna give us war subsidies, why don't you just ally with me, you stupid assholes. Alright, well, it looks like we have to recruit some dipshits. At least we have some money coming in. Yeah, a little bit of money. I can't believe Tibet joined against us. Stupid motherfuckers. Okie dokie. So we're going to send some of you guys up there. Some of you guys down here. Some of you guys over here. Some of you guys over here. Some of you guys over here. We need access with you. Thank you. That means some of you guys are going over here. Some of you guys over here. And etc. ad nauseum. Jin wants to ally with us. Sure. It's better than having no allies. I can't believe Tibet joined against us. That is just... That is some bullshit. Nope. No peace. Okay. Whoa. Rebels. Oh, those are my rebels. Cool. Then we will leave them alone. Actually, I don't think we can attack them, can we? We'll see. I don't think we can. Stupid Tibet. I think we'll pass right through them because they are technically our rebels. Actually, you know what? Let's not find out. Let's go the other way. Yeah. Hold on. Something's attacking something. Oh. I think I meant I don't think I meant to hit that assault button. Oh well. All 
Alright, so we're assaulting a lot of stuff at the same time. Wow, it's already done. Uh, let's go over here and take care of Tibet. Fuck you, Tibet. Break our alliance. Have to wait for some of these guys to lose an alliance, and then we can get an alliance. You want what's white piece? Oh, they actually do have some soldiers. I'm surprised. They have mostly cavalry, though. Whatever. Let's go over there with 6,000 versus their 4,000. See if we can even get there in time. Shit. Alright, we got there in time. Good, good. And they have no generals, so we're going to win. At least I think we're going to win. Come on. All right, they're running away to Comdo. All right, and they have one guy sitting there. Okay, they're definitely going to be defending, so it's fine, I guess. So what do we want out of this war? We can only take three. Actually, we can probably take four, because as people were saying, our infamy limit will go up because our prestige will go up. Yeah, plus 0.27. Well, only a little bit. But I'm thinking we might be able to bump it up to uh, uh, 6 point something. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll try it eventually. Wow. Uh, there's nothing else for us to siege, I guess. Just go sit over here. Oh, you have money we can take too. Nice. I'll take your money as soon as, a, as, soon as we're ready. Right, you guys should want peace now because we're about to enter your land. No, really. All right. Although they have recruited another unit during our trip over here. Now we have a negative five penalty here. Ouch. Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Song? Oh, Song got there first? No, we took Hong Kong. God damn it, we took Hong Kong. Now we're gonna... Oh, shit. Fuck you, Song. Fuck you. Well, we're winning the morale war, at least. Alright, well, can we get what we want? 
Yes, we can. But that'll put us over the infamy limit. No, it won't. We'll be fine. Alright. And then we just have to hope that the rebels will uh, get some more land for us. Okay. Do you have any dollars I can take? Ooh. So if we bump it up to 27 war score, we can take 175 bucks. I think that is well worth the wait. Yeah. I guess we'll just siege Comdo. What? I got Chihan Patriots spawning on my head. That's no good. Twenty-five percent. Let those Patriots stand there. Alright, that should be enough. 28%. Okay, good. Bingo. And that should put us under the limit, and we can take... Oh, they lost some gold. Oh, we'll wait for January. In January, they should have some more gold, right? Maybe? Hopefully. Give me January, and we'll get peace. Stupid rebels. Oh. <laughs> you guys want peace yet? No. You guys are stupid. Alright, January. Let's hope they have money now. So I'd like some dollars. Some reparations for this fucking war, you know? Okay, I want those same four provinces. Very good. That'll bring us up to 6.2 infamy. Oh, they have even less money now. Shoot. Well, I don't care about your cores. Your cores can suck my nut. Oh, we can uh, force their religion. That'd be kind of cool, but we're not gonna. So, uh... You know what? I'm curious if we can bump this up and even take Hainan as well. Oh, they won't even do it. Because our infamy will go down slightly over time, and our infamy limit will go up because we're gonna have more prestige. Nah, we'll play it safe. We'll just do that. Alright, see so our infamy limit wants a 6.9. Alright, let's send these guys back home. Send all of our dudes to here. And hopefully these rebels will get some more land for us. That'd be really cool. Stupid Tibet. The fuck is wrong with you? Bring our funding down to two gold a month. Ooh, we have an heir, finally. Three, four, four. Man, that's crappy. Can you get me a better heir? For fuck's sake. Hmm. 
We should probably spend some of our prestige on some paintings. Get some better advisors. They're at 100% with the walls breached. God damn it. Sieges are just so quick. You're not even out of condo yet. Damn. Yep, they got it. And they got a core. Fuck you. Now our people are almost there. They've converted Dolly. Cool. So Wu now has a core down here. Good for you, Wu. should be able to kill them with this army. I hope. So we've gained quite a bit of territory just at the very early parts of this game. Nah, lose money or stability. We'll lose stability, because we can get stability back just with a slider change. We Bring our treasury up a little bit. And reclaim the Ning. Pitiful. That's what she said. Oh man, our, our army's morale is 1.01 .01 as the maximum. That is sad. Well, whatever. I wonder how much land Ming and Fong are, I mean, Ming and Song are going to take from Yuan. I mean, this is this is a pretty quick disintegration of Yuan. Wow, we're only making six gold a year. Damn, that's bad. There we go. All right, let's base you in Heichi. And put you back on Hunt Rebels. Oh my god, you're taking attrition there? Really? Wow, these provinces have real low support limits. All right, we'll break you in half. No, we'll just take out four dudes. All soldiers. You guys go chill here. You guys will be hunt rebels. Because most of our revolt risk is over here anyway. Yeah. All right, so I think we're good. Thank you, for, thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode today. You know, I'm just having fun chewing on Yuan. This is what China is going to be like for a long time to come, I, I bet, just because the infamy limit we have is ridiculous.
So Jin took nothing out of that war. Interesting. But Ming will undoubtedly take a lot of shit because their infamy limit is 19. So they can take 19 provinces all at once. Wow. Alright, we'll pause here. We'll save the game.